Good morning. The thing that is on my mind this morning is the importance of creating your own personal hashtag. I have to tell you, I stayed away from this for a long time because it just felt very, I don't know, like I would think I was all full of myself if I created my own hashtag. And then I realized a lot of the people that I follow do. So I am a big LinkedIn user and on LinkedIn, Shay Robottom has a hashtag called Shay Shine. And I realized I can follow her on any social media platform by clicking on Shay Shine. And the other thing that's cool about that is if you think about so many different digital platforms, um, it, sometimes the name that you want is taken. Well, if you have that personal hashtag, people can find you so easily and you can move that across different um, username. So I have a couple of different sites on Instagram and I use my hashtag on all of them. So no matter where you're at, you can find me. So here's how you come up with your own personal hashtag. And you can do this whether you're building a side hustle, a business, or a personal brand. The best way that I have found to do that is sit down and write a list of words that resonate with you. Words that really describe who you are, what you're all about, what you're going to be, um, what your content is all about, and put that aside for a couple of days. And then come back to it, look at it again, and find different combinations of words that just really resonate with you. And then string a couple of them together that are super easy to remember, like Shay Shine, so that you uh, can create that hashtag that people will remember and follow. So for me, I do a lot of work with professional women, helping them rise in their careers. So Rise came up uh, for me. And then I also really believe in just adding sparkle to your day and um, creating a life that you love. So my hashtag is sparkle and rise. And you never know what's gonna come out of that hashtag. So I've created a community on Facebook uh, called Sparkle and Rise. We've launched a magazine called Sparkle and Rise and who knows where that's gonna go. And I've been using Sparkle and Rise for about a year and I've really seen uh, an, an uptick in the folks that are following me. The other thing uh, is sometimes you'll have more than one hashtag. So inside of our Sparkle and Rise Facebook community, we are Rise Sisters. So I've recently started using hashtag Rise Sisters. So once you find that string, kind of look out and see, is anybody else using it as unique as you can make it, the better. If you're the only one using it, that's fantastic. Make it memorable, make sure it's on brand for you and use it in every single post on across all of your social media platforms and it will help increase the um, findability. I don't know if that's a word, but we're gonna use it. It'll increase your findability and it'll also help set you apart as a thought leader in the space where you're building your personal brand. All right guys, hope you have a wonderful day and I will see you next time. Bye.